I'm Matt from the Retrofit Source, and I'm going to show you about the different connections on our low beam heavy duty relay harnesses. You'll notice at the center of the harness there's two relays, one relay for each side of the car, uh, basically so the, the ballasts have independent power. Uh, when you actually mount these relays in the car, you're going to want to use this mounting bracket and make sure that the relays both face upwards. And this will ensure the best longevity of them, uh, basically so no moisture gets into the contacts and corrodes them over time. Stemming out from the relays, we have a handful of connections. Really, there's, there's only five, so it's not very complicated. Uh, there are two identical connectors like this. It's a 9006 female connector, and these are going to be your outputs for your ballast. All the ballasts you'll get from TRS are going to have a similar input, just like this one. So it'll connect right in there, clip it in nice and firm. Uh, you'll notice that on one of those connectors, the output cord is a lot longer, and this is so that you can reach the power to the opposite side of the car, because you're going to have to connect to the car battery over on this side. Uh, these terminals right here is for a positive with the fuse, negative, uh, or a ground with the black wire. So you just want to make sure you've got a perfect connection with the terminals on the car battery with this one and this one. Uh, depending on your particular model of harness, you may have two ground cables instead of one. Uh, the harness functions exactly the same, so just something to keep in mind. Uh, the last and most important connection on the harness is actually the input trigger. On the harness is only going to be one of these and it may differ, it might look a little bit different depending on your model. This is a 9006 for example, uh, but the H7s, the H11s, H1s, they look a little bit different. Basically what this is, is going to plug into the factory outlet which used to plug into the halogen light bulb. Uh, essentially it just turns on the harness, high, um, you know, triggers the relay so that they draw power from the battery and send it out to the ballast. So this is the trigger for the harness and again there's just one. You'll plug it into the side closer to the car battery.